Hey, what is everybody? Today in this video, I'm going to teach you guys how to speed up your uh, Windows computer ultimately fast, okay? Um, yeah, this is on the 2018, and this should be working on any computer that you guys are using. It may be on a Windows 10 uh, Pro or a workstation and home, whatsoever uh, the flavor that you guys are using. This might be the same for you. So, all you guys need to do is just follow me on this video right now. So the very first thing is that uh, uh, you know we are going to be using the ultimate power source on the Windows 10, uh, which you guys need to really activate that uh, using the command prompt. So open up your CMD and right click and run as administrative and click on yes. This is proper for you. And make sure that you guys are looking here as a Windows 4 slash System 32. So this is the admin grant um, of your command prompt. Now all you guys need to do is copy uh, the text or code from the link under the description down below just go to my description link and you will find the same code alright so all you guys need to do is paste here that code and yeah all of the useful link will be under my description down below you know you just go ahead and click on the link and you will find all of the useful stuff so guys right now you want to paste here the code and so this is the code that it will activate uh, your uh, ultimate power source I mean okay so if you guys uh, see the power option here on to to the power plant here you can see on the additional there will be the ultimate performance okay so uh, to enable this you need to uh, use this command so just so guys just press this out and click on enter and you guys are done so now you can use the ultimate performance so just go ahead and click on ultimate performance now warning guys if you guys are on the laptop you might um, drain the battery super fast uh, after using the ultimate powers uh, ultimate performance all right so uh, make sure that you guys are on a charging mode while you guys are been using the uh, ultimate performance because it's going to drain up so much battery life on your laptop so make sure to uh, choose the ult ultimate performance if you guys are using desktop definitely use this out and if you guys are on your laptop make sure to plug your power source before you activate this so uh, you can also you know choose the balance recommended after you don't like this so I'll just choose the ultimate performance now after activating this your computer is uh, 2x faster so open up your uh, this PC menu here and now you want to go to properties and then click on change setting now all you guys want to do here is go to the advanced tab now go to the settings and go to advanced tab again and change the RAM here so make sure that it's been unchecked uh, the automatically when it's, it must be unchecked and give it as a custom size and we want to make the swap memory this is the virtual memory and it will be used uh, against your RAM okay uh, so let's say that my RAM is uh, 4 gigabyte, then you can give uh, as much you guys want. But this will use your hardest storage, uh, so make sure to give as you do have the enough space on your C drive. So make sure to use that. Okay, so uh, I will give this as the uh, 4 gigabyte of initial space and 400 and 4001. Or also you can give this uh, initial phase as 2000 and click on a set now you must restore the computer to, uh, to run this okay so press on ok and then click on ok and click on apply press on ok press on ok now click on the restore later or you can also restart now uh, if you guys um, want to see some changes so I'll restart this later and close this all now you want to go to text manager and you want to see here as the startup okay like I do have you enable this Spotify and order all I've disabled you can see that and you can boot this uh, super fast and quick so now I'll disable this and also guys uh, some people uh, say that you wanna disable some services but I do not recommend do this okay because once you trigger uh, the status to the disable mod 
you can't uh, change later when the Windows will give you the major updates, okay? And I really don't recommend you to play with this thing. And I've done this like a ton of time, and I faced a problem while updating that your you can't that you guys can't update this uh, perfectly. So I definitely don't recommend you guys to disable doing this shit, uh, you know, things on here, because the thing here is that so once you have disabled this. You will not know later, like it, it will be uh, later, like five months or six months when the major updates come, and you don't know what you have disabled. It. So if you guys want to disable, make sure to note that down, and you want to uh, re-enable while the major update occur on the Windows 10. So this is the Windows 10 latest version here I'm using right now. So and the last thing here is that you want to use the cleaner app. And I'm using the Jet Clean. Um, I love the Jet Clean more than the CC Cleaner because it do great job. So here is also the CC Cleaner, and the link will be under my description. You guys want to download the Jet Cleaner, CC Cleaner, and both app will be under my description down below. So just go ahead and click and click on yes, run as administrator like that. Now uh, all you guys want to do here is can. So we are in the last phase which is RAM cleaning and definitely check up my RAM here, um, uh, the performance, okay, see the memory you can see, just the Bandicam is running. So click on the repair or you can also so down and uh, PC after repair that but I uh, recommend you to repair right now. The fix will be totally uh, fast more than scanning. So I also recommend you guys to use this software twice a week or once a week because you know, there will be a lot of junk file whenever you are um, you know, working through your uh, computer. So make sure to install the JetClean or CC Cleaner. So the best part of the JetClean is that uh, it's completely and totally free and whereas the CC Cleaner, uh, it do have a business plan and some kind of uh, you know client plan and there are a lot of price range on the CC cleaner so I really don't like the CC cleaner and also it will give you the free trial but with the jet clean it's totally free there is no any kind of trial or something like that so you can download the jet clean for completely free so guys make sure to use the jet clean or CC cleaner that it's all depend on you now your PC will be uh, you know much much faster than uh, the past moment that you guys are using so make sure to try that out and to see my performance here, you can see uh, the uh, memory. It was a 24% uh, when I saw you. Now it's a 19. Um, as as we use the jet clean to clean up our RAM, as you can see, it just cleaned 600 megabyte, which is huge. So um, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you find this video really helpful. And if you guys really like this video, uh, make sure to subscribe to my channel. And also ring that notification bell to get some email notification whenever I publish the video. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next time.